Do you or a loved one have a pacemaker? Did you know that sometimes animals and pets need pacemakers too? And they could use your pacemaker. My name is Laura Hurd, and I have been helping people with end-of-life documents since 1987 in San Antonio, Texas. And if this idea appeals to you, then do a little research and contact a local veterinarian, animal hospital, or zoo and find out if they can use your and who would be the person in charge of keeping it after you die until such time as they could use it. Because legally you cannot donate your pacemaker to another human, but you can donate it to be used on an animal. Now there are two options to get this done. One, you could simply tell your executor that these are your wishes and your executor, once you've passed away, could make sure that all these arrangements are made. But the better option is to put your instructions in your will or your nation of agent to control your remains. And the reason this is better is because what if your executor dies before you do or is not able to serve as executor? Would your alternate or your substitute executor executor know your instructions and desires regarding the pacemaker? And what if a family member objects? There could be a lot of drama and family fighting over whether or not this gets done or not if nothing's put in writing. So the safest thing to do is to put it in your designation of agent to control remains, and then that agent has the legal power to make sure that your wishes are carried out. Follow me, and until next time.